Okay, so you said, um, what was the tenant lawyer? Um, give me one second. Let me give the number for you. And I apologize. I thought that's what victim assistant means. Was that, like, like there's an organization that helps victims of crime. And I apologize, or I would have never uh, contacted y'all. No, it's okay. Um, so I'm, I'm trying to get you to the, the proper um, organizations because, like I said, we don't really assist with anything legal related. We're not qualified to do so. Um, but we, we do help you get the proper referrals so that that way you know uh, what organizations to get in contact with. Okay. One second, I'm trying to get the number for you. Okay, so the number is 800. To what? Oh, yeah. 800. Okay. Yes, ma'am. 593. Okay. Eight two two two. Okay. Okay. So this is to get in contact with them for a wrongful eviction. And I, I was just, it's just, it's troubling to me. I don't understand why the police commissioner and the and the mayor's office um, would direct me to you if if you couldn't help me. So a lot of the times, um, they don't really know what it is that our program is able to assist with. Um, but because we work out of the police stations, they're usually the first person to refer to. Um, but we, so if you need relocation, um, it would, it has to be because, um, you said that it was related to the incident. So law enforcement would have to write a, a recommendation letter, um, stating that you have to move for your safety. Um, or if you are in counseling, um, then you can get a letter from a counselor. Um, if you do have to move um, for your mental health well-being, um, then if you have that, then you, you might be able to apply for a relocation. Um, but for now, if you think that it's for a, wrong, a wrongful eviction, then I recommend getting in contact with these agencies. Well, that's not, that's not even, that doesn't have anything to do with it. Because the eviction came way, the, evic, the false unlawful eviction came after. It was because the retaliation of them sexually assaulting my wife. Yeah, and, and the best thing that you can do is, is just is, um, getting in contact with a legal aid agency and see you, well, if, so that they can explain to you what your rights are. Um, because, like I said, we're not qualified to do so. I'm not informed on how on the laws, um, but an attorney would be the best person to inform you on what, st what are the proper steps to take. Okay, so there's basically no secur security for American citizens against LAPD corruption? There is, and and the attorneys are the ones that can better explain to you how it is that you can protect yourself. Um, and we don't have the, the resources, but these legal organizations do, um, so they would be your best option. Okay, what's your name, ma'am? My name is Maristela. Uh, how do you spell that? M-A-R. Uh-huh. I-C. Uh-huh. E-L-A. Okay. Thank you. No problem.